How is it going everybody? You're watching that about tech and today I'm going to show you how to get a refund for an app store or iTunes store purchase. So let's say you bought an app here from the app store or maybe you subscribe to a service through the app store or even an in-app purchase or through the iTunes store. Maybe you bought a movie, a song or anything that you regret. So you don't want it anymore. You don't want that purchase. You just want to get a refund because maybe you regret it. Maybe you bought it unintentionally or maybe your kids bought it for you. Your son, your daughter, they bought it. And of course, you want to cancel and get a refund, get your money back. So let me show you how to get it. It's super simple and it always works. So I've bought this game right here, RFS, a few minutes ago. It's a paid game, it's 99 cents, and I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna get my money back. All you have to do is open up Safari, and we have to do it through the browser, okay? And then we're gonna go to this website, which is report a problem dot apple dot com as you can see right here report a problem dot apple dot com i'm gonna have a link in the description and on the screen as well so you can go let it load and then right off the bat it's gonna ask you for your credentials your apple id and your password so you can fill it in of course this is an apple website so you can type it in no problem just tap on continue and then authenticate with your face ID, touch ID, or even you can type it in your Apple ID password manually. Now, let it load, let it load the website. And as you can see here, that's exactly what we want. All of the purchases linked to my Apple ID. So as you can see here, we have the apps, the in-app purchases, the subscription plans, uh, and of course, all of the purchases made through the iTunes store. So then movies, songs, absolutely everything linked to your Apple ID. Even free app purchases will be here. And as you can see here, it's separated by date. And we have my game that I mentioned that I've, that I've bought, that I've downloaded a few minutes ago, and it says pending purchases. And I'm going to talk about that in a second. So. How can you actually get a refund? How can you get your money back from any of those purchases? And it's super easy. All you have to do here is tap at the top below what can we help you with? And then you can tap on request a refund as easy as that. And right here below, uh, you're going to tell more. So what exactly happened? So I did not mean to buy this. So it was unintentional or maybe a child minor made the purchase without permission. And of course, we have a ton of possibilities right here. You can put what suits you best. So I'm going to tap here on I did not mean to buy this and then tap on next. And then, as you can see, we have here all of those purchases and we can select the purchase we want to get a refund. As you can see, we don't have the app right here, the game that I've downloaded a few minutes ago, and that's because it's still pending. It takes a little while for Apple to process those uh, app purchases or any purchase for that matter. So then if you have just bought something, just wait a little bit until Apple process the payment process the purchase and then it'll show up right here. It can take up to two days, so just be patient and wait for it to be processed. And then of course, you'll be able to request a refund. Now, let me show you how to do it. All you have to do is tap on whatever you wanna request a refund. I'm gonna use this Disney Plus monthly subscription as an example. And then you can go ahead and tap on submit. So let it load, let it do its thing. It's gonna take a second. And then, as you can see right here, your request has been submitted, allow up to 48 hours for an update. So it should take around two days for Apple to reply back to you, and then they'll say if you are eligible or not for the refund. But from my experience, and I have a video on this that I made years ago, and everyone says that Apple will give you a refund in most, in the biggest majority of cases. So then you will get a refund don't worry, all right? So that's it, that's literally it. How to get a refund for any App Store or iTunes Store purchase. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll be back in a few days as usual. Bye-bye.